Hi everyone, I'm Lawrence and in this video I'm going to talk about the Mortal Kombat game on the PlayStation Vita. Mortal Kombat on the PlayStation Vita is amazing. It's the same game as the PS3 version but with one extra challenge tower. And there you get 150 bonus challenges and other bonus content tailored for the Vita as you will see in the video. So basically you get more than the PS3 version. The graphics look obviously downgraded but still manage to look good and you get some touchscreen based challenges where you have to touch the screen to dodge rockets for example or wipe the blood out of the screen or play fruit ninja in mortal kombat style or others where you have to use the gyroscope in rest the game is the same as the ps3 version and this is a compliment since the ps3 is a console you can't play on the go it's a plug bound console while the vita you can take it on the go, so for a handheld game, this is mighty impressive. You get roughly the same characters as in the PS3 version, I say roughly because the roster is a bit rearranged and it depends if your version has all the DLC, DLC content or not. Anyway, you should expect around 30 or so characters and around as many stages you can fight in. Also, when you go to the crypt, you will be amazed how much stuff is there to unlock. Also compared to the PS3 version, the PlayStation Vita version is the complete version. So on the Vita you get way more content, more characters, more art, more stuff. As for game modes, you get a story mode where you get an alternative history, where Raiden delivers a message to himself to save the world from Shao Kahn. You get some unskippable cutscenes here, but still the transition from cutscene to gameplay it's still pretty good, even if it emphasizes a little that the Vita is slightly downgraded graphically. Other modes include a challenge tower, the same challenge tower from the PS3 version, and a bonus challenge tower, where you use the Vita gimmicks. Here you get the extra 150 bonus challenges I've told you about earlier. Also the controls are nice. You can play the game like you would on PS3 with button combinations, or you can use the touchscreen for fatalities. Also you get a lot of freedom here. The game doesn't force on you which controls you should use. It's up to you. Overall the game is amazing. It's a must have on the Vita. It's the PS3 version slightly downscaled graphically but with bonus content. And the simple fact that you get a PS3 game on the go is amazing. Yet alone an amazing Mortal Kombat game. It's a clear recommendation. You must have this one on your Vita.